A person stole an ambulance that was here outside Research Medical Center, then crashed it a little ways away, sending multiple people to the hospital with serious injuries. We are out there trying to protect the public and somebody came in and, and disrupted that. Assistant Fire Chief Jimmy Walker is saddened by this. Police say a woman stole a KCFD ambulance parked in the ambulance base at Research. When they had gotten out and turned around, someone hopped in the ambulance and uh, drove off. This is video after the thief took off. Kansas City police say she was speeding west down Meyer and crashed into four vehicles. The ambulance went up and down Meyer Boulevard and then caused a collision at the intersection basically of 71 Highway. Sergeant Jake Bikina says the driver went off the roadway, hit a tree and went down an embankment before stopping on Prospect. After all of that kind of chaos uh, settled down, uh, the investigation that unfolds is, uh, is a stolen auto. Bikina says two drivers were seriously hurt and taken to the hospital. The other two walked away. Walker says the ambulance, city property, also saw extensive damage. A quick search online shows emergency vehicles could cost anywhere between $120,000 and $320,000. The one silver lining for this is that it was an older unit that was going to be cycled out. This less expensive piece of city property was a backup. His crew was using it the day it was stolen. The normal unit was in the shop. While choosing to find a bright side, Walker says this silly decision put the community in harm's way in more ways than one. It took one of our ambulance units out, out of service for a, for a few hours while they could go grab a replacement unit and get back in service. So uh, unfortunately, somebody from the public put some uh, other citizens in, uh, in danger. At last check, the driver of the stolen ambulance was taken to the hospital and is expected to be okay. Reagan Porter, Fox 4, working for you.